Okay, I'm seeing nothing but a black screen. Okay, that's working. Okay, brilliant. That's turned on. Only one thing left to do, I suppose. Hello! Yo, everybody! Welcome back to the stream. Uh, let me just pin this comment I've got going here. Yes, lad, we're back! Finally, this update is almost done. Four minutes remaining. I decided not to start the stream until it was a little bit further along. Check Bam's stream. I have been watching Bam's stream. I have seen a couple of new things. I am very excited to get into that. The Oasisaur is a lot smaller than I thought it would be, actually. I thought it would be much bigger than it is. Um, hello, hello, everyone. Hi, I'm back. We're streaming once again. Um, yeah, can't wait to get into the Scorched Earth content. It's a bit of a shame they're delaying the uh, official servers. I was quite excited to get into some small tribes, but it's alright. We're just going to have to wait on that. How old am I? Oh, I'm 19. Um... But yeah, we got three minutes left on our download, so... Yeah, it shouldn't take too long, hopefully. Bob's Tall Tales pack brings both Aberration and Extinction whenever they release, right? I'm pretty sure they do. I think buying the DLC basically gets you everything as the content releases. Um, I already found mesh rat holes. Oh my god. Oh, if you find any rat holes, please, please send them to me on Discord. <laughs> They'll probably be in a rat hole video, but I'd appreciate it. Opinion on the new underwater cave. I only saw a glimpse of it. I need to check it out in its, like, full glory. Um, but I, I did see a little bit of it on Bam's stream. I'm excited to, to look into that. Try to find more. Yeah, if you, if you see any rat holes, please message me. <laughs> Let me know. Um, but, yeah, is I just want to double check. Is the background music all good? My voice all good? We'll test the uh, the game audio in a second when we get into the into the map. Uh, but let me know if that's going all good. I found some mesh rat holes, but you can only enter with Pelagornis. Ah, they probably won't be allowed on official servers then, or unofficial. What do you reckon of the Wild West and buildings and stuff? Oh, they look amazing. I can't lie. Like, it looks so good. Remember to drink water. When can we expect 100 days on this map? I, I think I will do one. Um, probably after a Small Tribe series, though. I really want to try and get a few episodes out on Small Tribes. The map looks amazing. Yeah, it does. It looks so good. I'm so keen to get onto it. One minute remaining. We're so close. I think it will. I think meshing will be easy on the new map, yeah. Um... Unfortunately, just because it's new, but I'm sure they will patch it eventually. It's just going to take a little bit of time. Can you do a series on unofficial? Uh, yes, actually, I just finished recording one on the Xavi servers, so that'll be coming up sometime in the next few weeks. Probably next week or so. Um, was it worth the wait? I don't know yet. <laughs> I got 30 seconds left on my update. Um, do you think they should make breeding more realistic in Ark? I, I think breeding's probably okay. I think that's that's the least of my worries about what they could fix. Um, 
Hello, hello. If you've just joined the stream, we're about to get into the Scorched Earth map. Very exciting, very exciting stuff. Very exciting stuff. Two seconds. Okay, we're in, we're in. Let's go, let's launch it. Ah, oh, I'm keen, I'm keen to get into it. I need to check out the Oasis or I really want to check out the new dino as well, but um, I think a lot of a lot of other YouTubers have probably covered that new dino, but I'll, I'll check it out. Um, you got to record with Xavi again, bro. That one wipe you all did was so fun. That wipe was amazing, actually. That was one of my more fun wipes. Oh, they've re first thing I've noticed here is they've removed um, Survival of the Fittest, which is interesting. Scorched Earth, finally. We have a different map to play with. Oh, it's a good feeling. Um, mine's still updating, so I get to see it early. Do you think wildcard... Mate, I'm not answering this wildcard dinosaur breeding questions. <laughs> that is, that's not for me. Okay, so I think spawn regions are pretty much the same. This desert wasteland was a turning point for Helena animation. and her allies. It was here that her fellow explorer Rockwell began his spiral into darkness. If only Helena could have seen the threat that was so close to her, where Rockwell's experiments would lead. There's danger lurking beneath these sands, Survivor. Seek out this Ark's Guardian and find your way to where I'm waiting for you. Okay, interesting animation. So after that island, oh, we got the Bob's go Tales next? animation, oh, so I'll, just, I'll stay quiet for this part. Before we keep going, I was thinking maybe you want to let your dad know where you ran off to. I don't want to think about him at all. I want to hear more stories, Uncle Bob. Uh, okay, okay. How about a story with spurs, and six shoes, and all that? Yeah. How long does this go for? Darling, you don't know the half of it. This is, this is interesting. Name, That's one way to, to, to show put it. Wild and woolly wastelands. <laughs> Who's boss? What am I watching? Whoa, now we're talking. The place was hotter than heck, and all that dang dust had a way um, of working its way up your uh, nose. Point is, I was gonna have to get lean and mean. I was fixing to tame anything. I feel like they should put the effort they put into this stuff into the actual, like, game. Um, if that makes sense. But we're here. We're spawning in. It, it does look good. It looks so much better. This actually looks like ten times better. Let me just gamma up quickly. Wow. So like, first thing I'm noticing is the sky is so much, like the the lighting, it just works so much better with the environment. Um, it's not as bright and like glary as it used to be on Ark Survival Evolved. Have I seen the church cave? I, I haven't seen that yet, but we will head over there soon. Um, oh wow, it's got precocters on. Even the cactus just, wow. They've, you can tell they've put a lot of effort into this. Vitality is the first. Yeah, I'm definitely not the first. If I had faster internet, maybe. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go into creative mode and we're going to check everything out. I really want to go and find the Oasisaur first. I think it's around... I think I saw it spawned in like the June part. I don't know if that's accurate though. Is official down? Yeah, official servers haven't been released yet. I'm hoping it gets released soon so I can start playing on small tribes. But in the meantime, we're just exploring the map and all of the new content. Um, does anyone know if the Oasis Source spawns in the dunes? I think it does, but... I can't be 100% certain. Which graphics card do I have? I have a 4070 Ti, and it seems it runs the game okay, which is good. But yeah, this this looks beautiful. This is there's so much like attention to detail. 
Oh wow, that is that that that's different for sure. Oh wow, yeah. Okay. I think there's gonna be a lot of new rat holes in this. Um, I'm seeing some like little cave things, yeah. I'm gonna have to get a base location video out soon, I think. <laughs> Priority number one. Oasisaur has the same spawn rate as a Titanosaur. I was informed in another stream. Okay, cool. So, Titanosaurs, there's only three Titanosaur spawns per map, so there's only three. Oh, wow, this looks like 50 times better. Oh, my days. Oh, my God. If you were to put, like, the old Wyvern Trench next to this, it'd be, like, a shocking difference. This is, this is so impressive. Check if the old Red Orb or Rat Hole is still there. Yes, actually, I need to do that. We'll check that. I want to check out all the Rat Holes I know. Um, hopefully we see an Oasis or along the way. But I think there's going to be a lot of new ones. I'm getting that, I'm getting that vibe. Um, like even, what is this? Are these just archways? I think it's supposed to be here, is it not? I think they've like completely removed it. Is this not where it's supposed to be? There's usually a, like, there's a rat hole. I think it is supposed to be here. Damn, so they've like completely modified parts of the map. So I could have sworn the, uh, that rat hole was just before the Wyvern Trench in this sort of area near Red Ob. It's on the other way. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Are you sure? I don't... I'm just gonna say it. None of this looks familiar to me. <laughs> it's all looking very new. Um, how much FPS do I get? I think I'll check. Uh, roughly like 50, 60, 40. I cap it out at 60 um, for some reason. Oh wow, this this just looks... This is like 10 times better. Okay, I'm actually so hyped to play this. Far out. Okay, um, first things to check... I reckon we do the items first, because I think it's going to take a little bit of time to actually find the tames. Because uh, I've been flying around for a little bit and I haven't seen the Oasis or yet. So I'm going to try and get some of these... Get some of these items out of the way. I know the new things we got were like... Shovels? Okay, yeah, we got shovels, train tracks, train engine, train platform, train track, okay. Uh, what else did we get? Does anyone... Does anyone remember? <laughs> I think we got... Okay, we got all this, like, new... Okay, these are skins. I don't really want them. What's that? A bottle? Shootable bottle. Interesting. We'll have to check that out. Treasure chest, that's definitely new. Uh, shovel. A coffin. <laughs> Swivel stool. Saloon table. Uh, saloon chair. Whip looks very different as well. Drawing paper? Okay. Interesting. Platform car, yeah, we've already got that. Uh, I know the it's like a wagon's new, isn't it? Dynamite? Yeah, we'll grab that as well. Barrel storage. What else we got here that's new? Poker table? Okay. Town bell. 
Plant pot. Oh, that's awesome. Piano. Uh, I think we've always had mirror. Lamps. Interesting. I'm just trying to recognize what's actually different. Yeah, we're going to explore most of the caves if we can. We're going to see as much as possible. Uh, probably all the rat holes I can remember as well. But I just want to go through the, the items first. Dynamite? Okay. Oh, it's just a skin. So you drag it onto the C4. It's not a new explosive. Intro. I think that m rocket homing missile looks different. Some of the pictures are very different, but... I think that's all the new items here. So let's, let's get some stone foundations down. Or the adobe, actually. Let's see how they're looking. Alright. Oh, we've got a bit of a lightning storm happening as well. Alright, let's get a platform out and let's see what we what we've got here. Table? Okay. It kind of like snaps to the middle of the foundation. I don't really see there being much use for this. <laughs> Aside from PV uh, stuff, like making things look good. The coffin? That's hella interesting as well. Can you get in it or something? It's like a bed. You can fast travel. Um, capture a snapshot? Interesting. Can't really think of a use for that, but I guess it's convenient to have. <laughs> Drawing paper? You can pretty much place that anywhere. Okay, I guess we, fi we found a use for the table. I suppose you just use uh, like a paintbrush to paint on it. I think I've got to turn the game sound down a little bit. Uh, hopefully the audio is better. Are there small servers? No, there's not, unfortunately. They were delayed. Shootable bottle. Oh, we got to try this, actually. This is going to be insane. If this actually is like... That's odd, man. It's like when you break crystal and it makes a glass breaking sound. They just re reuse the uh, the sound effect or something. That's that's kind of cool. I guess this is like target practice, I suppose. Oh, get in! Come on. I don't think we missed a single shot there. Um, primitive shovel. I don't really know what we're shoveling here. We're digging something though, that's for sure. Cannot dig this surface. I guess you've got to look for like mounds or something to dig up. I don't know, might come back to that one. What else we got here? Piano? How do we play this? Can I actually play it? Oh my god, you can play like the theme songs. I think. Main theme. Let's let's try and play that. This is really a uh, an in-depth musical instrument here. Oh, you can. You, I think you can hear the piano. Or is that the lo-fi music? I might need to turn my uh, my music volume up. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> nice. I feel like I'm hearing some violins in there that aren't really played on a piano, but... That's pretty cool, I guess. I'll turn my... Uh... 
music volume back down. W or L? I think... I think it's a W. I'm, I'm, I reckon all this new stuff is pretty cool. It does seem like it's more based for PvE players, uh, opposed to PvP, but still pretty cool. I mean, barrels, you can store some stuff in there. The poker table is pretty cool, I guess. It is all very PvE kind of. Oh, you can actually play poker. A highly competitive version of poker. Players sit down and wager any items they want in a long-form tournament-style game. Interesting. Sit and go, a more casual version of poker. Yeah, let's do that. So I guess we can, like, bet items. Oh. Okay, purchase 100. Okay. There's genuine poker in Ark now, guys. <laughs> I don't really know what to do. <laughs> okay, well that that's interesting. I don't that's definitely more of a PvE kind of thing, but I guess that'll be fun to play with friends. Plant pot. Yeah, I saw something about the shovel in chat. Someone was saying something. Yeah, okay. I I I was wrong. I mean, it looks nice. What else we got? Saloon chair. Well, that will go well with the table. Fancy armchair. You can sit on it. Nice. <laughs> uh, I really want to check out these trains. I think that's the next thing I need to do, but... Platform cart that can be built on and pulled by many creatures. This is separate to the trains. It does need a roulette table, I agree. Any ETA on small servers? No, I don't I haven't seen anything on small servers yet. You need a plant pot and you can till it. I don't know what it does. <laughs> okay, we'll test that out. We've got a plant pot here. Oh we had one, yeah. Remove foliage. Nice. Right, let's try shovel that. Yeah, okay, I don't know what, what the go is with that. It's weird because a lot of people have SC servers up, but I still have no option. In the trailer, there was someone digging a chest out the ground with a shovel. Yeah, I, I did see that. I think, like, I did get the treasure chest thing here. It just kind of seems like a storage box. I think you can use the shovel to dig up, um, like, resources, but... Or, like, artif I mean, not artifacts, like, good loot and stuff. But I think you need to find, like, a mound to do it on. So I don't know where they spawn. Uh, we might have a look around for some of them. Crop plot is what you meant. Okay, I'll, I'll try that. We'll, uh, we'll attack it with a shovel. Soil tilled, growth bonus 30%. Okay. So it seems like it maybe grows plant species X faster and like any other crops. Can you hold E and bury the treasure chest? Let's check. No, you can't, unfortunately. I think it might just be a storage box kind of thing. Welcome back, mate. Welcome back to the stream. <laughs> they actually have this, like, floating dead bushes and stuff. Very cool. It's a town bell as well. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, so far, none of this stuff is, like, groundbreaking in the PvP scene, from what I can tell. So it doesn't seem to be... Okay, I'm going to just shut this up. It doesn't seem to be uh, that big of a problem so far. Well, this is a tiny stool. Who on earth is sitting on that? It's built for like a... 5 foot 3 tall man. Kevin Hart could probably sit on this. 
it's interesting. Wooden hanging sign. I guess I, I need to hang this from a, a ceiling, maybe. Is this the Beach Bob's Adventure DLC or Scorched Earth? It's both at the minute. We're on the Scorched Earth map, but we're kind of just testing out the uh, the stuff from the the Beach Bob DLC or however, however you say it. The Bob's Tall Tales. That's it. Just gonna make a wall and test out this wooden hanging sign. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's pretty cool, I guess. It's not the uh, the worst addition. Okay, I think we've done pretty much everything except the trains, and that's the most excited. That's that's the thing I'm most excited about. Test to see if dynamite is throwable. I think it's just a C4 skin. I don't think it's a, a separate explosive, unfortunately. It would have been pretty cool if you could throw it. Am I blind? Oh, it's in the cosmetics, that's why. Yeah, I think it is just a, a C4 skin, unfortunately. Yeah, that is a shame because I think it would have been cool to get some new explosives, uh, but it's alright, it's not bad as a skin. Build a train, see if you can place tarts on it. Yep, that's the that's the next thing we're going to do. So the tracks are absolutely massive. Like, humongous. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna run into some... Okay, there we go. So you can kind of like build it up. But you need foundational support. Interesting. Alright, we're gonna build a roller coaster. It's gonna go off the edge here. It is quite PvE, I do agree. I was worried a lot of this stuff would be way too overpowered, but it doesn't seem to be the case so far. Okay, this is about to be the train journey of the century. Train engine. The main engine car for traveling along train tracks and can pull platform cars along with it. Requires charcoal to run. How do I place it? Oh, add train. Okay, there we go. The train is added. It's facing the wrong direction, but that's okay. Out of fuel. Oh, that's... I guess I need to add some of that. Um... How long till Smalls is up? I, I don't know when Small Tribes is releasing. I am keeping an eye on the community page though, so as soon as I find out, I'll let you guys know. Yeah, I'll get some charcoal. Give resources. Surely we get some from that. Yeah, we do. Okay, we're actually, we can actually have a train in Ark. That's wild. <laughs> it's pretty slow. And unfortunately, we can't make it fall off the cliff, but... That is quite sick. Um, I want to try and add the... The platform car. We'll see if we can put turrets on that. Nice base location under cliff at 24 lap 52 long. Okay, I'll check that out next. I just want to finish up with the trains. How do I get them to stop? Is it like rust? Oh, that looks so sick.
Okay, I'm not gonna lie, the trains are almost exactly like Ross. Like, the way they, like, stop and start. You can you control them in the exact same way. Add cart. Let's see if we can do that. We've done it? Okay, can you build on it is the question. No, you can't. So what's the point of the carts then? Is it just to transfer... It must be just to get around the map with tames and stuff. Definitely can't put heavies on them, that's for sure. Um, see if walls snap. Oh, they do! What on earth? Okay, that's... that's... that's wild. So you could have a base on here. You can actually place most structures, I'm guessing. Can you get, like, Fabricator? No, okay. Oh yeah, you can, you can. Okay, that's actually wild. Try autos, put a vault. We'll try that. I think it's gonna be, like, a platform saddle, so you... You won't be able to... Put things like this on it. What? Okay, I'll take that back. You can actually put a vault on a train. I can already imagine the YouTube titles. Surviving a hundred days on a train, yeah. That is exactly what I was thinking. Auto turrets. No, these these don't these don't place unfortunately. Um, let's try cryo fridge. Cryo fridge places as well? Okay. So it actually lets you place a lot more than a platform saddle does. Because those two structures aren't normally allowed. I wonder how high you can bring the walls. Okay, only three high. Interesting. This is how I survived an entire wipe on a train video. <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to be the first one to do it. <laughs> okay, this is this is sick. I feel like you could make a base here, but it would get annihilated in seconds. That is so silly, the way it, it moves. That is pretty sick, though. Try put a ceiling and then turret above it. Yeah, I'll try that. I'll try Plant Species X as well. No, it doesn't look like turrets are allowed at all. Yeah, we'll try Plant Species X. Yeah, Plant Species X can. I mean, I'm assuming so if the crop plot can. That is kind of wild. You can have a whole circus, yep. Try for Structure Limit and Plant X. I, I think Plant X you can have, but I will try the Structure Limit. Um, I'm just going to place a bunch of these. Actually, we'll do mortar and pestles because they're a lot smaller. I'm guessing it will have a structure limit, but then again, this thing has surprised me. It's not looking it's not looking like it so far. I could not have placed this in a more Unfortunate position, that's alright, we'll just go up a level. How many cards can you pull though? We'll test that as well. I just want to check if there's a, a structure limit, because if there's not, that is kind of OP. I'm beginning to think there is no structural in it. <laughs> yeah, there, there's there's not. For sure there's not. Gotta try putting the seed in it. Um, 
I'll give that a go. I, I mean, if I don't see why it wouldn't let the the plant species X grow. Sorry, I just have to look up the spawn command. I, actually, I can't find it right now. Um, try putting ceilings wider out. That's a good idea. Looks like you can go one out. Ooh, that's odd. So you can go one out everywhere, but one at the back and one at the front. That's about as far as you can take it. Although you can... Yeah, I can put one there, but I can't put one there. You can make a very odd platform shape. But I suppose that's pretty cool. I'm gonna see how many carts we can pull on one train. I might have to go and place the train tracks in a better spot. There aren't even plant X on Scorchstar there now. I actually don't know, that, that might be a good point. Um, go to cart? No. Detach cart? Oh, you can detach the cart. Might have to add the cart on the train itself. I don't know, we're gonna go to a flatter location and try, try and add like a really long train track. This seems perfect. Whoops. Okay, it's not snapping for whatever reason. Okay, there we go. So yeah, you can also get different tracks here. You can get ones that like split off and disconnect, so you can go two different directions. Hey Vitality, how you doing? I'm doing good, thanks. How are you? Um, Try the, sp try the command SDF Oasis 1 might work like ASC spawns. Okay, I'll try that in a sec. Try to add more from the train when attached to the other one. Yeah, I will, um, I'm just going to make a bigger train track here so we can test it out more efficiently. But you can have like an anti, like two different direction track here. I don't know what two way merge, three, ma three way merge. Train track short. Oh, that is very short. Train track connector. Interesting. Right, that is a very long train track. Let's try that. If they didn't add plant X to Scorch, starting off is a lot harder. I kind of agree, yeah. Although putting plant species X on a moving train seems really overpowered in a way. Okay, we've got a bunch of different... Oh, that's platforms. I need a train platform. Alright, we've got a bunch of those. Let's see how many we can add. Uh, we can only add one, I think. It's when you go to the train. Oh no. Oh no, you can do way more than one. Let's see if it stops me. Nope, it does not look like it's stopping me. I think the only limit is going to be the train track itself. I found an OP rat hole in Wyvern Trench. If you, yeah, if you send that to me on Discord, I'd greatly appreciate it. <laughs> but if not, understandable. Um, let's bring the train all the way to the end here and see if we can add any more. I need charcoal, that's right. Uh, doing good, love your vids. Uh, that's great to hear, mate. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Let's get some charcoal in there.
Doesn't seem to affect the speed either. Oh, we've picked up a Paracer there. Alright, let's see if we can add any more. Oh, this might be this might be the maximum amount, to be honest. Put pillars under the elevated train tracks and see if it counts as foundational support. Yeah, we'll give that a go. I need to kill these tames that are getting on my nerves. I wonder if you can like snap foundations to the train tracks. No, it doesn't doesn't really look like it. Um So I think the max amount of cards you can have is five. Doesn't seem to be letting me place any more. From what I can tell. Oops, accidentally picked that up. Can you get out of it, man? Or it was just being a pain. That's very interesting, though. Is there anything else? Oh, mate, thank you for the. Uh, I don't want to butcher. You. I can't. I don't want to butcher your name on accident. But thank you, mate. I really appreciate it. Try to put multiple trains on one track with adding the carts. See if I can... I might have to pick this one up. And we'll reconnect these train tracks. Can I add another train? No, you can't. Train placement is obstructed, so it looks like you can only have one train per track. Uh, check the Manticore Ascension, that's actually a good idea. I actually cannot wait to start looking for rat holes. Uh, was there any more items we missed? Well, I think we've covered them all except the wagon, which I think we need a tame for, if I'm not mistaken. So it looks like that in the trailer. We'll just quickly check the wagon out, and then we'll we'll go and explore the ascension because apparently that is new. I'm just looking for a tame I could. What what tame could pull a wagon? Ah, <laughs> oh, it was obstructed by me standing on the tracks. Right, yeah, that could be it. Oh my days! Yeah, you can actually add way more than one train. Okay, maybe not way more than one. Maybe the limit's two. Yeah. This... This is kind of crazy. The PvP on these things is going to be so much fun. Never mind, yeah. You can- infinite trains. <laughs> That's wild. That seems like a- a problem. <laughs> I don't know if Wildcards thought that one through. Far out. That is gonna be absolutely hectic. They're quite expensive though, I must admit. Thousand metal. I mean, they're not that bad. If you're a big tribe, you're not really struggling for resources. Servers are up. No way. You haven't been on. I got to check the uh, official Ark survival. 
Twitter handle. You're on a small server right now. Alright, well, I guess we're loading it up. Um, very quickly before we do that, let's test out the wagon. Oh. Can you stop, mate? You're interfering right now. Surely this thing can pull it, right? We'll go into slow motion mode so we can force tame it. Okay, brilliant. So, platform can be pulled by many creatures. I wonder how it works. I wonder if it's only specific tames as well. It's, it's not been very clear. Where is the oasis or? I think only three oasis ores spawn per map and I haven't actually come across one yet. But yeah, I would like to check one out before I went on to small tribes. They seem to be very elusive creatures. Oh, it's the new, uh, the new tame here, the fellow Suchus. That thing is sick, actually. I was watching, uh, I think it was, it wasn't Bamstream, it was Ra's Clock, I think. Spawn them in, yeah. It has a slot for cart. I didn't see one on the, in its inventory. Okay, we'll try Tame a Horse, that's gotta be. Surely you can pull a, a a wagon with a horse. I'd be shocked if you couldn't. Oh yeah, you can. Ah, oh, I see. That's interesting. That is very interesting. So... But it's not actually letting me put it in there. Might have to remove the bowler. I'll get a saddle on it, maybe it's that as well. Yeah, so you need a saddle. Oh, okay, that is... That's kind of goofy the way that works. <laughs> These physics are not really the best I've ever seen. <laughs> Interesting. Wonder if you can put turrets on that. Only one way to find out. Oh my god, you can. Um, wild card? What? This can't be serious, right? You're joking me. You're taking me for a, a, a ride. This is so OP. What on earth? Um, oh, I don't need cables anymore, do I? What is going on? How, okay. I feel like this is a problem. <laughs> that is, this is going to break the game. That is an OP fob and a half. Let's see if it actually shoots. Because maybe it's like a... It doesn't shoot kind of thing. Nope. It's definitely shooting. Yeah, that, that's not OP at all. Congrat- Mate, what is going on? This is going to be like... 
an insane tactic. Movable fob. Can you build a battle quets platform on it? Um, I don't know. I, I might have to check the structure limit because this is ridiculous. See if I can expand it. So you can put foundations on it and they kind of sink into the wagon, which is, I suppose, kind of cool. And you can build out like a surprising amount. Okay, I don't, I don't think Wildcard have thought this one through. This is so goofy, what the hell? <laughs> Yeah, not game breaking at all. If I pre place foundations, turrets won't work, really? I think turrets, I think they will. You can also like, oh, okay, you can't place them too far away from the platform, but you can really extend them out a bit. That is quite possibly the most interesting addition so far, I think. Yeah, what was wildcard thinking? See if you can go up with walls and ceilings, that's a good idea. Yeah, you, you definitely can. Okay, you can only go up one though. Which I suppose is a bit of a saving grace. Yeah, it doesn't seem like you can go any higher than that. But you can place a turret on a ceiling. This is so broken. Kill horse and see if wagon breaks. That is an actual really good idea. I think it will. I'm just going to use my admin. Yeah, so if you kill the tame, the wagon and all of the structures breaks as well. Um, what other dinos can be saddled with a cart? That is a great question. I'm, I'm assuming it's like all the smaller stuff like parasaurs and horses and that type of thing. But what would actually be like an OP tame for a, a cart? Maybe a stego? They've got quite a bit of health. You can have two floors. Yeah, you can have two floors on the wagon. Maybe trike? Yeah, trike would be really OP actually. Um, and hitting the cart hurts the tame too. Okay. Unless you can put this on a quetz, we are good. I doubt you can put it on a quetz. You can't put it on the uh, big Morella top things, so I'd be very surprised if you could do that. Turtle? I mean, yeah, I suppose. I think Trike is probably the more... OP thing because you could walk it into a turret base and be soaking and you'd like have turrets on the back of it to stop people from like exiting their base or something like that would be so overpowered um, this map does look amazing though I will say Right, I'm still yet to find an oasis ore. That's like the big thing I really want to go and find. I'm struggling. Uh, some guy said there was a rat hole somewhere in the chat. I, if, if you're still here, mate, do you mind dropping the cords again? So I'm just, I'm having a look around. Because if the small tribe servers are up, we're going to get straight on that. Okay, this is new as well. It's all new, like everything's changed, which is quite exciting. Has 
Has the map changed much? Yeah, the map is really different. Like, there's entire rat holes that don't exist anymore. Um, like, all this mountainous stuff has all been redone. I think, like, the core elements of the map are still there, but it has changed quite a bit. I do want to check this cave out, actually. Or is this not a cave? This is a coliseum. My bad. Definitely not a cave. <laughs> 24 lap, 52 long. Alright, we'll head there. Okay. No such thing as GPS, apparently. Twenty-four lat. Oh right, yeah, this is ASA, not ASE. What time will servers drop? I'm not sure. People have been saying in chat that the servers have already dropped on small tribes, but I don't know if that's true or not. I hate that cut already. Lol, that's a game killer. Yeah, it kind of is. <laughs> I can't lie. Twenty-four fifty-two. Okay, this is like all brand new. Twenty-four point one. Fifty-two point five. So it's like right here. Oh yeah, is this it here? This is very small. <laughs> I don't know if this has got potential to be built in for a rat hole, but I mean... It's, it's not the worst thing in the world, I guess. I mean, yeah, you can't even put a foundation in there. Small tribes are up. Okay, we, we will head over there in a sec. Um, that was the rat hole, yeah? Or am I missing something? Two storage boxes and it's filled, yeah. No, it's below the... Okay. Is it this one? I feel like this is quite OP. Quite like this, yeah. I'd be down to put a base in here on small tribes. Assuming you can build in it. Um... Yeah, let me know if that's the rat hole you were talking about. Let's explore a note there. That's it, yeah. I might... You know what? Yeah, I might actually go and try and claim that on small tribes. But yeah, this is all so different. I reckon there will be a ton of new rat holes. Just because they've made so many changes to like the cliff faces. Um, but you know, nothing wrong with that. Alright, I'm going to remember where that is so we can head there. I'm just going to take a screenshot. Check if it's 6x. Yeah, that's actually a good idea as well. I don't, I don't think it would be. We'll use the new dynamite skin. <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's not 6x. Does so anyone know of any more rat holes we can check out while we're on the map? If not, that's all good. We will probably head over to Smalls because I'm not having any luck finding the Oasis or... That's the main thing I really want to try and check out, but... Doesn't seem to be... Doesn't seem to be nicing me, unfortunately.
Let's go small tribes, yeah. Solo small tribes. The best way to play the game. Does anyone know the uh, spawn command, maybe, for Oasis? Or I don't know if it's probably out yet, but... It's not in the dunes, it's inland. Oh, interesting. I'm waiting for your 100 day video on a cart already. <laughs> yeah, for sure. 100 days on a train as well. There's a bit of fog now. Just what I need to find the Oasis or make it harder for me, why don't you game? Titanosaur? We seem to be finding plenty of those. What specs have I got on my PC? Um, I've got a 4070 Ti. I think it's 64 gigabytes of RAM. To be honest, I've forgotten what my CPU is, but... I can definitely find it for you. Can you check... Church and Central Cave? Yeah, I can. If you guys drop the chords for that... I'll try to spawn the Oasis or in. This command uh, doesn't seem to be working, unfortunately. You already found a way to mesh? I'm not surprised, mate. I had a feeling the uh, the game would be a little bit like that. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I've just found a way to mesh as well. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, no. Please, please fix this. Are you kidding me? For a second I thought I was about to fly into an overpowered rat hole or something, but... Oh, man. Well, I wouldn't build anywhere around here on official. They took that long to make Scorched Earth and you find a mesh hole in five minutes. I know, it's ridiculous. Um, yeah, that's, that's a bit wild. I mean, I guess it is what it is. Hopefully they fix that. Vitality on the live stream. What a beautiful Tuesday. It's crazy. I know it's my second live stream ever. <laughs> First one was earlier this morning. I'm kind of just exploring the map right now. I'm, I'm trying to search for rat holes, but so far I've only found one mesh hole, which doesn't really count. I feel like there are going to be a lot though, I'm just a bit blind at the minute. Red obelisk in the water? What, is that a rat hole or a mesh spot? Uh, there's a bit of a... Oh, can you get out of the way, mate? I'm actually stuck. Okay. Is this what you meant?
I'm not seeing any uh, mesh holes or rat holes. Oh, okay, this must be the underwater cave, yeah. Um, right. I'm just gonna say, like, how is someone supposed to soak a base on Scorched Earth without water tames? Like, you can't tame a bassy, can you? That seems like a bit of an oversight. You can't really bring a stego down here either. I guess rock golems, because they don't, um, they don't, I don't think they drown, do they? But a, a water cave on Scorched Earth is wild, not gonna lie. It's not what I was expecting, that's for sure. Um, okay, this is unbelievable. <laughs> if, yeah, okay. Sure, wild card. <laughs> this is like the biggest cave I've ever seen. And it's got like an underwater entrance that you can't really soak. Oxy Stego? Yeah. I guess that's the only way. I mean, you'd have to pump oxygen on a Stego. Which still makes it really OP. GM summon Oasis or character. Okay, we'll do that. Yeah, it is gorgeous. I will say the, they've paid so much attention to detail. I wish they'd done the same for like checking for meshing and meshing rat holes, but it is a really beautiful cave, I will say. Um, is it the Ascension Cave? Probably unbuildable. I think, I don't know. Oh. I mean, you might be able to like tell people not to build here on unofficials, but I don't think it's going to be that. Regulated. Oh, it looks like drops spawn in here as well. Gonna have fun with it until it gets nerfed? Yeah, I think it will get nerfed. <laughs> when Wildcard realized you can't really soak an underwater cave on Scorched Earth. At least not easily. Um, that is interesting though. I'm gonna check out the Oasis Ore now. Now that we've got the spawn command. Are there stegos on Scorched? I think there are, yeah. GM summon. Oasisaur. Underscore. Character. That didn't work, although we are experiencing a sandstorm, which is interesting. Yeah, there's only one entrance to that cave, I'm pretty sure as well. Yeah, I agree. Oasis, best cave, no competition. Honestly, they have, like, they've made an insane cave. Okay, this sandstorm is kind of doing my head in, not going to lie. Try and speed it up and get rid of it. Underscore BP, yeah, that's my bad. I'll try that one again. Just waiting for this sandstorm to pass. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, that's sick, actually, the way it, like, moves. Kind of, like, spreads across the map. Right, uh... Let's try that. Oasisaur underscore character underscore BP underscore C 150 Nope, that, that one didn't work either, unfortunately. Do I know the command to get rid of trees? I do not, sorry brother. 
This, like... This area looks a lot more, like, dead than the rest of the map. Which is kind of interesting. Um, but yeah, it looks like have not been able to find the Oasis Source, so we might just head over to Small Tribes. Summon Oasis Source. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm going to be able to find the command, unfortunately. These ones don't seem to be working. Cheat GM Summon. Okay, we'll try that. One more try. No, that didn't work either, unfortunately. Oh, we got it! We got it! We got it! Never mind, never mind. I take it back. Thank you guys. Thank you everyone in the chat that was sending me the command. <laughs> I appreciate it. Okay, this thing is kind of goofy as hell. <laughs> what the? Why is his face like that? I mean, it's kind of cute. Um, it's not as big as I thought it would be. I feel like it's a little bit smaller. I don't know what... That's interesting. Um... I guess this is the regenerative pool, yeah. Gaia's Embrace. Oh, this is sick. Oh no, this is actually so cool. I can see the next video title. Surviving 100 days on an Oasis or... Yeah, that, this is so cool. Yeah, you do have to buy the creature, unfortunately. Um, it is part of the Bob's Tall Tales DLC. But I don't think you can place turrets on it. Okay. Never mind. Uh, wait. Maybe the reason I can place turrets is because I've got structure collision disabled. But still, that means you can place it on unofficial. That's still ridiculous. We'll turn that setting back on. Um, could you get that dino on official? Yeah, I think you can. I thought it would be bigger. I thought it would be bigger, but that's still massive. Yeah, I thought the same. Okay, you can place turrets on the Oasis or. Um, a flying base with turrets seems a bit broken. If I'm being completely honest. Oh, 203,000 health. What? What? What is going on? Yeah, it wouldn't let Ben place the turrets. I don't really know why it's letting me place them. I'm so- I'm really confused. Two hundred K HP new soaker. Yeah, that's what it seems to be. Okay, so I can't place turrets, but I, okay, I can place foundations. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Can't place cryo fridge. 
Can't place vaults. But I can place turrets. Turrets on the side of it. No, doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, hang on. You can on its legs. Maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. It's showing up green there, but Yeah. No, I don't know what the go is with that. Grind station, starter base for sure. I mean, yeah. I just want to try and land it and see if I can put it on the legs. Okay, that that animation is sick. I will, I'll give them that. Um. Yeah, so maybe you can't put the turrets on the legs, but still, I I didn't think you'd be able to put them on the top. Although you seem to be able to only do it sideways. Maybe it's just glitched for me or something, because that seems very overpowered. You can just shoot it to death from the bottom, so not that broken. Yeah, that is true. Although, 200,000 health. That's a bit wild. How's it saddle? I was looking for the saddle, but I don't see one. I don't think they have a saddle. Yeah, honestly. I mean, aside from the wagon, that's the only game-breaking thing I can think of. But this doesn't seem that overpowered. Like, you could very easily raid a base on here. You can use it to fob people and won't need to Fortnite. Yeah, true, you could use it to soak quite easily as well. HP is way too overpowered, I do agree. It has a saddle slot. Yeah, that is true. I wonder where the saddle is. I don't know, I'm not, I'm not seeing anything new. But isn't the wagon because you have that command on? I don't, I don't know. I think I might have accidentally turned it on and I had it off the whole time. Let's try it. We'll, we'll, we'll mess around with our settings very quickly. Disable structure placement collision. Yeah, I had it the right way around the first time. So yeah, that wagon thing is still super overpowered. Don't tell me you can breed them. Oh, we should check that actually. You can soak while having turrets to stop people from defending. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And you can have that for the trike as well with a wagon. Assuming the trike can pull the wagon. Okay, it's landing by itself over there. Yeah. You almost got 90k subs. I know, we're getting so close. Um, any help any help towards the 100k subscriber goal is greatly appreciated. Thank you all so much for being in the stream as well. 220 people, um, and we're just checking out the map. We got 54 likes, which is amazing as well. Uh, if you haven't already, make sure to like the stream. Uh, but yeah, we've pretty much covered a lot of the new content so far. I think it might be time to head over to Small Tribes, because it sounds like those maps are up now. So to counter that raid, you drive a cart under it with turrets and shoot it down from, from below. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Crazy. Um, yeah, anyway, 
Let's head over to Small Tribes, I guess. 200 people watching is absolutely crazy. Thank you guys so much. What is the cart you're on about? So, um, if you didn't catch the earlier part of the stream, we connected a cart to a horse and you could actually put turrets on the cart, which meant you could basically drive it wherever you wanted to, which is just way too OP. Okay, looks like maps are actually out. I don't know why I'm typing that. We need small tribes. Um, okay, so these are all the capped maps. I kind of I don't want to leak the map I'm joining, so I might just hold on. There we go. We'll just we'll choose a random map. Um, but yeah, we're just joining now. We've got to download the mods, unfortunately. But once we do that, I'll get my screen back on the right thing. So I think it's doing something different. Just don't want to leak the server I'm joining. Okay, there we go. Took turret traps to another level. I know it's going to be so overpowered, but yeah, we'll th we'll worry about that later. <laughs> I got to make my character. Just going to make everything as small as possible. Apparently, I don't have anything to download, so we're going to have to do it manually. Update your OBS. Yeah, I need to do that. <laughs> I've been putting that off, not going to lie. So, arm length and hand size will make max... Foot size will make lack max, and everything else will do small as possible. Oh, mate, I've just I've ruined it. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, I don't want to have to do all this stuff again. My bad, my bad. Bear with me, bear with me. Bear with me. We're making the most, the smallest character we possibly can. Probably want to make the head a bit smaller too, because it's going to be like a moving target. There we go. Keep the hairstyle stuff. <laughs> she does not look happy right now. Alright. Okay, character is ready to go. Save your character build at the bottom. Yeah, I will. Um... Bailey on her way over, she's going to have to watch the stream with me. 100% mate. <laughs> We're about to start off on the Small Tribes uh, solo series. Um, how do you tame an Oasis or That's a great question. I didn't even dive into that. I actually have no idea. I probably should have looked into that, but the Small Tribes servers have released. So we kind of need to get on that. <laughs> Otherwise people are going to take our base location. 
So uh, what I'm also going to do is just quickly change the the name of the stream. Scorched Earth, Day One, Small Tribes, Solo. Brilliance. Okay, we're about to to get started. I'm back, baby. Nice. It's good to have you back, mate. Thanks for checking in on the stream. I heard someone say you need to cannon it. Yeah, that would make a lot of sense, I think. Um, do commentary like it's your usual solo series. You can use it later. That is the plan. <laughs> Hopefully I can upload this a little bit later. And hopefully that uh, lo-fi music isn't too loud either. Small Tribe Solo Series coming? Yep, we're starting now. All right, let's get stuck in. Uh, the map is pretty much opened up for me here. And I think the base location I want to try and claim is over there. trying to think where some notes might be but this doesn't we've already watched that and we've already so watched I that as well <laughs> trying to think where some notes might be but I can't be a hundred percent sure little lower on the background music okay I can do that no problems How's that? Let me know. Okay, so we're finally here on Scorched Earth. It's just been released. That was just a little intro for the, the YouTube solo series. <laughs> the live stream gets a bit of a behind the scene look. Let's get started here. I think the rates are actually so boosted as well because it's the Easter weekend. I think we're looking at like five times rates on small tribes. Um, so that's going to be quite handy as I go about surviving here. Anyone find a way to tame an oasis? Oh yeah, they're puzzling over it in chat right now. I'm already dying by like a million different things. This is rough. It's exactly how I remember Scorched Earth though, to be fair. Um, Yeah, we're getting levels pretty quickly, so I think you can bring your uh, character over from the island, but I have absolutely no idea what character, what server I was on. So we're just going to start fresh. It feels a bit more authentic anyway. Oh, bit of lag, which is not surprising. Most of the small tribe servers are capped at the minute, so it's going to be rough, but we'll get through it. This dehydration is just... Oh. I suppose it is Scorched Earth. I can't be complaining too much about it. Oh, it's a water jug there. Water bug. Oh, it's oil. I don't, I don't really need oil right now. Probably could have done with a... A water bug. We need to get set up so we can claim the OP rat hole from earlier. Yeah. I don't know how OP it's going to be, but oh, there's a water bug over there. How am I going to make it though? I'm going to die. This is rough. Oh, it's not even a water bug. It's a Lystro. Um, I really need to head to a, a water source, but the only ones that I know of are around the, the obelisks. 
So we might kill ourselves and go there instead because this is doing my head in. You're already dead, I know, mate. It's, mate, the environment is ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, there's a little water stream there. We might go there. Where is the closest stream? Yeah, should we just be down here? Yeah, there is. Okay. We'll start building up here. It'll be a lot easier. You kind of got to work with the environment on Scorched. It does get to you. How's the FPS and stability now? I never really had any issues when I was uh, playing. I got very, I got quite lucky because I've got a decent uh, PC. I've, I've spawned, I spawned in five seconds ago, and I'm already dying of dehydration. Everyone's here as well, by the way. I've seen like four people. Oh, can we take that bag? Nope, never mind. 100 stone, thanks mate, I'll take it. Servers came up yet? Yeah, we're playing on the small tribe servers at the moment. Hoping to get a decent start here. I've got a rat hole in mind I want to try and claim. Don't know how successful I'm going to be though, because quite a lot of people on the uh, on the clusters right now on the servers. Uh, but we're making some moves. We're making some moves. I need to get a probably get a foundation down, get some narcotics so we can tame a flyer. The only real flyers on Scorched Earth are Argies though. I'm not 100% sure where they spawn, so we might actually have to get a ground tame. Uh, but that's alright. I've got a 4070 Ti. That's my graphics card. It's the first live. It's actually the second live, but yes, the first day I've, I've tried to go live on my channel. Alright, um... I'm dying of dehydration once again. I, I believe that's going to be a common occurrence on this map. It's going to be a theme. I kind of want to tame that Iguanodon. What level is it though? Hey, this guy's got quite a bit of stuff here. Berries. Um, level 140. Oh, It's a bit of a high level, but I reckon it might be worth... Get one of these going. Spyglass, wooden bat. Need the mortar and pestle as well soon if we can. Um, I hope you don't get like heat stroke on Scorched Earth because that used to really annoy me on on Survival Evolved when it just made your screen go really blurry. Really it used to do my head in. Okay, I don't need I don't need that much stone. I need something to kill for hide. What do we got around here? It's a bunch of bigger tames, but I don't know. Okay, this is kinda of doing my head in. That looks like it might be stuck up there. Yeah, that is definitely stuck. Free bit of hide, surely. Oh. <laughs> is what it is. I feel like there's more water than before. I mean, I don't know about that. <laughs> Maybe it feels that way, but... Oh, what? How did that get out? 
wasn't really that stuck to begin with. So low as well. Really need the bow and arrow, Ingram. Oh, there's like little butterflies now as well. What dino do you hate the most? Trudons, hands down. There's no competition. It's like the worst dino they could have ever added. They don't add anything to the game. Controversial take, but I said it. <laughs> Torch OP it is. Um, oh, it's so low. Surely it runs into the water so we can get it. I'm, I'm going to die again. Right, I'm not dying in the uh, the water here, which is, I guess, all I can ask for. Out of stamina, broken bones. Could be another L here. It's a harsh environment. Pump fortitude. I don't know. Does that do much? I don't know. I've I've never really used that before. Hmm. Not a whole lot of, uh... Oh, we might be able to kill a Pegamastix. If we can get some stamina. Oh, I'm drowning, never mind. Dead by a Pegamastix, that is kind of, that is crazy. Kind of getting it handed to me right now by this map. It's a rough beginning to our Small Tribe series. Fortitude is a must. Okay, I, I, I've got to, I've definitely got to do that then. What the hell is this? Uh, I thought we'd found like a, a cave there. Someone died in the exact same spot as me. It's alright, hopefully we'll get a closer spawn to our... Our last bag. Should help better against the elements. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping it does, because otherwise it's going to be a rough... Oh, that's... Bro, this game is not... I spawned miles away from where I last died. And I've spawned next to this stuff. This could be wraps. Yeah, this is... I'm going to spawn somewhere new. This game is not... It's not working with me right now. Do you have a gaming computer? I do, yes. Alright, let's try somewhere... Okay, that, that should be a good spot. Just anywhere near water, really. Oh. It's a bit of a long walk towards water, but... Hopefully we'll make it. Nice. <laughs> yeah, this game, this this map is certainly, it's a tough one. It knows how to get you. I, it's been two, it's been like 20 seconds, not even. That's wild. Dehydrated after 10 seconds on the map. Absolutely insane. I can see the water in front of me as well. Alright, let's pump some fortitude then. See where that gets us. The level 4 experience, yeah, it's really, it's getting to me. What do you reckon is the hardest story map to play? Story map? Um, like, not DLC? <coughs> Maybe Valgaro? They need to fix that for sure. I, I agree, mate. It's it's, a, it's bonkers. It's alright though. We've made it to some water. Dude, 
building near water is going to be like an actual tactical advantage on these maps. Um, cactus sap give hydration. Yeah, I need to, I need to get on that. It's alright, we should be okay here. We're not dying of super heat, so we're, we're going to be able to make a ton more progress. Might turn the, uh, the lo-fi music up a little bit. Hopefully that's okay. Let me know in the chat if that's alright. I'm new and I already like your vids. Oh, I massively appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. The support means the world to me. Especially in the trying times like this one. <laughs> Dying of dehydration every 10 seconds. Maybe do no run on the island and pump fortitude. That is actually a genius idea. I don't know why I didn't think of that. That would have been so smart. Is that a job? Is that a Jaboa down there? Yeah, I think it is. All right, we'll get some some hide. Why haven't I disabled grass with iron eye? Yeah, probably I should do that as well. Oh, did bro drown down here? Must have. Take that. Alright, let's get like 10 of these. Some water skins so we can actually venture further away from the, the river. Mortar and pestle, bed, bow and arrow. You on solo and small tribes? Yes, I have. Grass dot size scale 0 0.2. Alright, that should lower the grass. TBH, I'd play ASA if the characters weren't so ugly. I mean, I, I don't think they're too ugly. I think they do need to be changed a little bit though. Might as well grab some flint while we're crafting stuff so we can get a bow and arrow together. Else can we craft here? I wouldn't mind actually making a campfire for some food as well. This guy's really backed me into a corner, hasn't he? Can you get out of the way, mate? I'm like, stuck on... You are really making life difficult for me. Cody with the donation, my friend. 99 cents, thank you so much. W, Cody. I agree. Thank you, my friend. That is greatly appreciated. Um, yeah, definitely don't have to donate... We're just chilling here, we're just vibing. Playing the small tribe servers on day one. But I do appreciate it all the same. Right, what is... What can we do here? I'm very heavy. It's probably something to do with the 100 sand I've got in my pocket. I'd play ASA if the HUD wasn't so disgusting. Fair enough. I don't think I can open this. I need to be level 25. Yeah. I'll take the oil, though. Oh, is that a juvenile parasol? We might get some prime here. What on earth is this? Juvenile parasol death essence. I guess you can... 
with that. Oh my, Casper Verdelin, two dollar forty nine pound euro. Sorry, my bad. I keep mixing up the currencies. Cody again with another two dollars. Forgot to write a message, bro. Thank you so much. That is crazy. That's so. Thank you so much. Um. So what this this must be what you put in the Oasis or yeah. It's absolutely useless to me right now though because I don't have an Oasis or. This music's a little bit loud. Turn it down a bit. Um, thank you so much. Forgot to write a message. Mate, you're all good. Uh, thank you as well, Caspar. Really appreciate it. Oh, I'm stuck again. What is this? Hey, Vitality. You're an awesome YouTuber. I'd never give up on your vids. Oh, thank you, mate. That's really, that's really kind. You take that new tame to a pool, yeah, I know, but I don't have an oasis all right now. <laughs> it's not a lot of, uh, it's not a lot of use to me, unfortunately. Lamantra, should I tame that? I don't know. Let's split our meat, so when it spoils, we can get some narcotics going. Yeah, double use in the chat, honestly. Thank you guys so much. There's a raptor down there. That could be a tame, you know. Just getting around, like, in the early game. I know it's kind of PvE of a thing to tame, but... Without, like, PTs and all that, I really could use a tame to try and get myself to some RGs. Okay, it's looking like a bit more of a dangerous area down here. I don't have a bow. It's alright, I'm just gonna have to run down with this. Oh, I didn't realize there were two of them. That's kind of not good. That's not good. It's alright, we should be okay. Kind of intense. Um, oh my god, Xenon with the $2.79. Oh, this is bad. I'll read that in a second, mate. Sorry, I'm just kind of in an intense moment here. Oh, this is bad. Yep, that's that's GG's. Um, I just subscribed. I'm going to start watching you more. Thank you, mate. I really appreciate it. We made it kind of far down here. We'll spawn here. That's really kind. Um, really appreciate that. Last death. Okay, we're really close, so we should be able to get our stuff back. Looks like we got the Easter event colors as well. I didn't notice at first, but everything's really like neon green. It's true. They are quite good at PvP, I will admit, yeah. Okay, thankfully they look preoccupied over there. Terrorbird could actually be a decent, a decent team. You missed Cody's third dono. Did I? Oh my, mate, thank you so much for a third donation. Love your vids, keep up the good work. You don't have to do all that, mate. I really appreciate it, but... Don't spend all your money. <laughs> thank you though, mate, I honestly... That is hella kind, mate. I really appreciate it. Hall of Fame live stream viewer. Uh, thank you, uh, AC, for pointing that out to me. My bad, mate. Uh, right, I was going to tame that raptor over there, but it's kind of in a precarious position between those two terror birds, so... Might keep looking for something that's on its own. We need to split the meat here. Might as well get a campfire going as well. Oh, that's not good. I hear dogs. I need to drop some stuff. Oh, 
We seem to be wandering into a bit more of a dangerous area. I'm not really that prepared to deal with all that just yet. Level 60 Terrorbird. That would be a perfect tame if I had narcotics. I'm not I'm not quite there yet, unfortunately. Oh, mate, this game absolutely loves me, doesn't it? Torch OP! Get some boomerangs? Oh, it's not a bad idea, actually. I forgot that they were on Scorched Earth. I mean, to be fair, we're not felt we're not far off trank arrows, so it's just waiting on the levels, really. Uh, we got a few levels there, though. Scorched Earth looks beautiful on Arc Ascended. I agree; it's it looks amazing. I'm actually really happy with how it's uh, ended up looking. Right, let's get a foundation going. Let's get some meat cooking. Oh, missing thatch, my bad. Alright, campfire, foundation, let's get uh, let's get a mortar and pestle down. 100 likes! That is crazy. Thank you guys so much. That is amazing. Uh, let's get this down. Oh, we, we already had one. My bad. Just put the campfire down here, I guess. Fill it with wood. Mortar and Pestle. Okay. Let's make a tribe name as well, actually. What should the tribe name be? Put in, leave in chat. I haven't thought about that yet. <laughs> Six narcotics. Okay, that's not too bad. Might try and get up to like 15 or something, and then we'll have enough for a, a terror bird or a raptor. Do I need a, a smithy for a terror bird saddle? Oh, I'm actually such a low level, that's my problem. I really need a, a note. I think raptor might be the only level we can afford, yeah. 33. Oh, we're a little bit away from that. Uh, how much was my computer? I'm not actually sure, I built it quite a while ago. And it was... Um, I don't know. It wasn't it wasn't cheap, but I I don't have the exact numbers. I could probably look look them up, but I'd have to do that off off stream. I need water. Oh, that's actually a great tribe name. <laughs> that's brilliant. It's absolute. It's absolutely true as well. Should probably rename the live stream to Dying of Thirst. But yeah, we're just gonna try and farm up some narcotics here. Narco berries, I believe. That's the right way to say it. Craft cooking pots? Yeah, I really should. If I find a note, I'll I'll make sure to do that. There's gotta be one nearby. These like butterflies are pretty sick as well. I don't know if many other people have noticed them, but they keep flying across my screen. Don't forget to use your water skins. Yeah. I need to remember to fill them up as well.
Amazing aim. Okay, surely that hits. Yeah, there we go, we got it. Where did that green terror bird go? Because I haven't seen it lately. We might be able to just head down and knock that raptor out immediately. Yeah, we should have enough narcotics actually. What level is Trank Arrows though? Unlock Hide. Oh, we got Smithy. Surely we've got it. Yeah, we do. Whip? Oh, it's going to be so nice to use whips on Arc Ascended, finally. That blue raptor looks sick. Yeah, I know, I really want to tame it. <laughs> I need to kill that green terror bird, though. Place a sleeping bag in case things go wrong. Alright. Let's head down there. Let's see if we can tame that raptor. What does the cart cost for behind a tame? That's actually a good point as well. We could use a, like a wagon, I think it's called, or cart. Nope, not, it's not called a wagon. Platform cart. Level 22, that's cheap as. We might be able to put that behind our raptor. That's going to look so silly, but we'll give it a try. Assuming we don't die here. It's a genius idea, yeah, put the wagon behind the raptor. It's level 70, that's kind of perfect as well. I didn't want it to be too high, but I'm glad it's not um, that low as well. We'll just kill this first. Oh, level 1. Battle quits, yeah. Oops, gone the wrong way. Oh, it's coming for me. Okay, we actually got so much hide from that. Swap out our arrows. We're just going to wait for that bowler timer to, to calm down on that raptor. And then we can hopefully knock this out. Yeah, there we go. I think 13 should be enough. There we go, unconscious. I was kind of worried it was going to die there, but that's alright. Hopefully it'll be safe here in this corner, although there's some... Things that are kind of making me think it won't be safe over here. Since when was there level 1s on smalls? Yeah, I don't know. It's an ASA thing, I guess. that thorny dragon. Gorgeous colors on the raptor, yeah. Why does this Loki look fun? Mate, I'm telling you. I've been trying to convince AC to play ASA for ages. And, uh, yeah, he's not been very keen on it, but it is a lot of fun, I will say. Oh, we can kill this, uh, this baby now, actually. Get the prime. Come over here, mate. Alright. Surely you give us a bit of prime. 
Yeah, we got one. Come on. Okay, I'll take one. One's okay. <laughs> there we go. Four levels from that. We'll get to 400 uh, weight and then we'll start pumping fortitude. I don't really need this juvenile parasaur, I can't lie. It's not really that handy, helpful for me. Might kill that scorpion actually, so we can get some chitin going. So that'll be the next thing we need. Raptor name Ocean or Aqua? Yeah, my... Honestly, yeah, that's not a bad idea. Cody for the donos. Actually, yes, I'm sorry. It's got to be Cody. Or Xenon with the $7. You find both new dinos in the dunes. Well, at least that's where I found them. Okay. Uh, I definitely need to go over there and check them out. I did sort of spend some time with the Oasisaur. Let's craft a Raptor saddle. Oh, did I craft one already? I didn't. Thank you so much for the donation, man. That is an absolute W. I think I got a... I gotta name the, the team after you, I think, mate. Xenon. Do the next one after Cody. Absolute goats. Absolute legends. W's in the chat for that. Cannot thank you guys enough. Um, okay, we need to do fortitude. And this thing's weight is so poor. <laughs> okay, platform cart. We need metal and paste, which is... It's not impossible. We can get that together. I think that is the way. This is obviously not ideal. The Samstorm proposed... Oh my god. $10 from Cody. Had to top it. Mate. This is ridiculous. I I don't know what to say. I feel bad naming the the raptor now. Do I change the name? Like, thank you so much, man. Cody coming for that crown. He actually is. Gonna have to. I feel like we should split the name. I need to. Am I gonna make it across this river? Cody slash Zenon is the new name. Yeah, absolute W. Thank you so much. Don't change it, mate. You're all good. Uh, I'll, I'm definitely naming the next one, mate. Definitely naming it the next one. Alright, how do I get up here again? This is an awful... Yeah, I don't... I don't this is a rough, like... Weather event. Zenodi, yeah. <laughs> I'll have to name the after that. We need a new team for Kobe. Cody, sorry. Yeah, I might team a Jabala, actually. And then I think it'll warn me when this is about to happen. Alright, we're just going to walk on foot because this is doing my head in. I can't see anything. No, oh my god. Zedon with $14, man. Me on top. <laughs> you guys have got to settle, like, stop fighting it out. Thank you so much, though. Like, genuinely, that's insane. That is the biggest donation I've ever had. Just make it follow you. Yeah, I will. I just can't really see where I'm going, so... Um, yeah, thank you so much, man. I'm actually, I'm so grateful. Absolutely insane. Okay, thankfully that storm has kind of passed. Ah, oh, Raptor keeps getting stuck. Come on, mate. Come up here. Come on, you can do it. You're almost there. Yeah, we got it. Tame a thorny, dra a thorny dragon? I don't know, that's... 
That could be a tough tame. <laughs> All right, we're looking pretty good for food. Um, I need to head to a place that's got some metal so we can make a wagon. So it might be time to pack up, try and throw out the stuff I don't really need so we're less heavy. I probably should have repaired my thing before I did that though. Oops. I did think that was going to happen. I think a Pegromastic stole my flint, which is dog of it. Don't know what I did to deserve that. How you doing, Vitality? I'm doing good, thanks. Thank you so much. Uh, how are you doing, mate? It's not letting me join the small servers. It just keeps kicking me to the home screen. Um, I don't know what to tell you, mate. Uh, maybe try restarting your computer? Right, what can we do? Lads! It's no way! $20 from Cody! I might have taken the W for this. I think you have, mate. I think you've definitely taken the W. Holy W, man. Oh, you're, you're both absolute legends. I do not deserve this. Thank you so much. W, Cody. Yeah, W's in the chat. That is ridiculous. Insane. Insane. Thank you so much, man. Absolutely wild. Alright, let's make some more bowl. That is ridiculous, man. Thank you so much. Okay, let's let's get a move on us. I cannot believe that. <laughs> oh man. Right, I better get some water actually. Because I am It's gonna be a bit of a rough journey back to here if I, I start running out. Actually, I'm just going to make a ton of these. Forget it. I'm just going to do as many as I can because I know I'm going to be dehydrated like 20 seconds from now. Yeah, I don't need the sand. Get some more fortitude into us. Alright, this should be enough water skins. I know they leak over time, but anything's better than nothing. What's our weight like? 75, mate. He should 100% be able to carry us. Oh, he is getting killed right now, though, by something. By a wolf. I need to lead this away, because this is going to be bad if I don't. Oh, man, he almost copped it. Okay, well, thankfully, we found that in time. Drop meat on Raptor. Yeah, true. That's actually probably doing quite a lot as well. I don't think this can pull a cart, unfortunately. It's got like... It's, it doesn't have an option for it, so... We might need to think of another tame to do that. Uh, but that's okay. Um, does anyone know where metal spawns on Scorched Earth? Would you be able to direct me by any chance? Oh, someone's already getting raided... As wild. Are you high enough for desert cloth armor yet? Uh, these are skins. I don't think I am. Oh, yeah, I am. Never mind. I'm capping. Yeah, right. We need to get some silk and we can craft some of that. Oh, there's a guy here. Oh, he's level 8. This is kind of rough. I, I feel bad. He died to a, a pig. Sorry, mate. That's my bad. <laughs> You're probably not going to have anything on you.
Is FPS better on Scorched Earth? I think so. I feel like it's a bit better. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna head this direction, if I can. Run away! Yeah, I know, I need to get out of here. Get silk from purple flower patches and get a tent so you can hide from, the, hide from the weather if you need to. That is a brilliant idea, mate. Thank you. I actually will do that. Oh, someone must have died here to some bugs. Ooh, this guy had a kit. I'll take that. Um, I'll sort through it in a second. trying to get as much chitin as I can at the moment because I know I'm going to need it for the the whatchamacallit the, the RG I don't really need hide oh my god Zenin $28 this is my final one but I love the stream sorry Cody my guy you, I, I am, you have no idea how appreciative I am of that. That is absolutely ridiculous. Double, yes, double you Zenin, double you Zenin. Thank you so much, man. I'm glad you're loving the stream. Um, I'm having a lot of fun playing Scorched Earth as well. It might not look at dying every 10 seconds from dehydration, but <laughs> trust me, I definitely am. we can kill this but that is ridiculous my friend thank you so much yeah double you Cody and Zen on I hope I'm saying that right both of you are just absolute legends yeah the small servers are out at the minute okay we got a bunch of silk let's make some desert cloth no way I need a smithy. Oh, that's rough. Okay, well... Still need to find a metal node somewhere. If anybody knows where one might be. I think I see one over there, actually. It's just I am dying of heat right now. Which is not ideal. Pull up the fortitude a bit. Yep, everyone here should definitely turn on notifications, 100% <laughs> metal spawns on the mountain. Yeah, I think I, I'm heading towards a metal spawn location over here. If I'm not mistaken. Can you fly on the Lamantra? You can, but it's really slow. I'd rather go and tame an RG if I can. Uh, Scorched Earth Smalls for free. You can, mate. You don't have to pay anything. It's only the DLC you need to pay for. Getting absolutely torn up out here. I think there should be metal up here. I'll be absolutely gobsmacked if there's not. Yeah, there is. Okay, we, we found some metal nodes here. There's also a parasol we could tame, because uh, I think they can pull the carts. But we're going to set up a little, probably a little stone one by one here. Get the metal smelting and then we can actually get some flak and all that. Oh, there is a, a dire wolf over there though. It's a bit worrying. Good night everyone. Good night mate. Uh, Dan Beekman, thank you so much for joining in on the stream. Massively appreciate it. Absolute legend. Uh, we are dying from dehydration once again. I, I did call it. I knew it was going to happen. 
It's a rough world out there. What are we missing? A bit more stone. Xbox FPS runs at 40 to 50, which is a big improvement. It used to be 30 only. Oh, there we have it. I'm glad it is better because it really needed to be. <laughs> I remember when it dropped, like, there was a lot of outrage about it. So I'm glad they're finally fixing it. Okay, let's get three stone walls. That might be all we need. If you got the fortitude, I, I am I'm still leveling fortitude. I just had to do weight first so we could get out of that immediate area. It's 5:28 a.m. here in the UK. We got the rough end of the stick. Yeah, you guys definitely did. Awful time to drop for the the people in the UK. Look at that sunset though. The the vibes are immaculate. It does feel like a whole new game. If I'm being completely honest. Oh, we can make a forge, brilliant. A whip as well. We're moving up in the world. Although we are slowly running out of water. <laughs> mm hmm. What are we missing for more stone walls? Stone. I mean, is it just me? The sky just, it feels so much more open, you know? It's really cinematic. It gives a, a really good feel. Maybe I'm just seeing things. Ah, no, I'm dehydrated game. This is Scorched Earth. You're close to Green Ob, yeah, should be water there. I am quite close to Green Ob, I might have to go for an excursion. Um, but I want to get this metal smelting first if I can help it. I need to drop this sand. That's what's, like, killing me right now. That water drops way too fast, I do agree. I think it's going to be a pain for a lot of people out there. Alright, one more wall, and then we just need stone for the ceiling. We've got our structure. This guy looks like the old Red Dead Redemption games. I was actually thinking that, like that is exactly what I was thinking. It looks like some western style kind of game. Scorched is rough, yeah. I'm going to have to sign off for tonight. I have a big test tomorrow. Good luck with the rest of the stream. Good night, everyone. Good night, mate. Thank you so much for joining in. Thank you so much for the donations as well. Uh, massively appreciate it. Yeah, honestly, absolutely insane. Thank you so much. Okay, we'll get this down here in the corner. It's really just a temporary base. It's not going to be, you know, a long-standing accommodation. So I don't really care how many people see it, but I might tuck it behind that tree, actually, now that I'm saying that. Okay, this is a bit ridiculous. Let's get a bit more stone so we can make another forge. I'm interested to see how night is going to look, actually. I might have to gamma up a little bit more. Oh, I actually went down there. Just so I can see. Hopefully that's not too bright for you guys in the stream. Place a bed, then you can just respawn for water. Yeah, I did place a, a sleeping bag over there. Okay, this, is, this looks nice and out of the way.
Uh, we'll just do a secret door. I know, I'm, I'm going to die game. I, I can feel it. Oh, we're only going to be able to do... You really can't place a lot in these structures, can you? Oh. Right. Let's just put it here. What was obstructing the forge? I don't even know. Something invisible, clearly. Right, what do we need for a bed? Wooden thatch. I don't want to destroy that tree, it's kind of covering my base. Thatch. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about dying here because I've got a sleeping bag. Or at least I should have put one down. I think I did. If I'm not mistaken. <laughs> yeah, I do. So easy. I haven't seen too many people out this way. I, I get the feeling that a lot of um, players are going to be stuck near water in the beginning. Just because you really can't make much progress without that. Adam, it's good to see you, mate. You're back. How was work, mate? That's my body. Hmm. What on earth? Did I accidentally, like... Am I... What on earth did I do with my body? <laughs> oh, it's up there. My bad. Good to be here, work was tough. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about it, mate. Near that weird tree. Weird it doesn't show your death mark, yeah. I don't know if I accidentally turned it off or something, but... That was a bit odd. We might have to make this into a 2x2 two two as well, by the way, because it's a lot smaller than I first remembered. <laughs> I thought a foundation could take a bit more than that. Alright. Are we going to get any metal from this rock? We actually have. Awesome. That's enough for a smithy, and I think it's almost enough for a pick as well. Uh, I hope you're having the best day ever. Thank you. Greatly appreciate that. Thank you for joining in on the stream. This sand is really filling my inventory up. Level 40, we're making big moves. I don't know how long we've been playing for, but it feels like, I don't know. It feels like it's taking me longer to make progress on, on this map. I think it's just because of how harsh it is, like trying to survive here. You can almost make a bed as well. Your character looks like Slenderman. Yeah, I do like to make the arms really long and just the character really small in general. Uh, but yeah, if you're new to the stream, um, we're still playing Scorched Earth, the brand new Arc Ascended map. Looks fairly, It looks quite good. I think it looks amazing. I think chat agrees. <laughs> Everyone seems to be quite impressed with the graphics and I am too, to be honest. Okay, bed has been made. Finally, we got some... Some security out here. We can afford to die. Mm, I 
think I need a bit more metal. Okay, yeah, that should be enough. Okay, I'm dying of the cold now and not the heat. That's wild. Bit of a a change for Bit of a change for once. It's usually never that way around. I think if we put the bed there, we should still be able to fit a smithy in. Alright, too easy. Where's that ceiling I had as well? I don't know where that went. Fortitude makes you more resilient to the elements and it makes you resist torps so it helps. Yeah, I, I do. I need to pump a bit more actually. 10's probably not enough. I'm just gonna kill myself. I hate walking around with broken bones. Deserts IRL are almost freezing at night. Well, that's cool. I guess it's good they've sort of added some more realism. I don't know if it was like that on the original Scorched Earth map. That rat hole I saw uh, earlier in the stream, it's probably long taken by now. But it's alright. Slow and steady wins the race. Definitely can't be rushing uh, Scorched Earth. It's kind of a, a pain. Let's get some wood in there like that. Faster we get some charcoal going, that'll be good as well. How much does Scorch Earth cost? It's actually free. It's a... It's a free DLC. Don't have to pay anything to to get it. It's just the... Just the, uh, the extra Bob's Tales DLC that costs money, unfortunately. Oh, I didn't mean to make that. I need to make one of those ones. Whoops. All maps from ASC will be free? Yeah, I think so. I don't know about the Genesis maps, but there's really no information on that just yet, so... At the moment, though, um... Yeah, I think... I think Extinction will be free, and I think Aberration will be as well. I was doing so good, but now I'm dying a lot. Yeah, it's it's very easy to die on Scorched. The map certainly knows how to get you. Bit more stone. Storm incoming? How can you tell? Oh, there's a Jaboa here. I'm actually going to tame this. Need to get a flyer? Yeah, I'm working towards getting an RG, but I really need, like, flak and crossbow and all that, because it's a bit of a, a journey to the closest RG spawn, I think. Come back! I'm going to use a bowler on this. There we go. It's knocked out. We gotta name that Jaboa Cody, the absolute goat who was donating in the chat earlier. It's about time we get a team named after him. Alright, Smithy, we'll get that down. It's actually a huge jump in progression right here. You're witnessing the, uh, oh no, don't tell me I can't place it. Okay, I'd rather sacrifice the bed. But I am kind of close to dying, so let's just make sure I can make another one. Alright. Okay, Smithy is going down. It's a huge moment. As soon as the wreckage dissipates. Maybe we can't place a Smithy there. I've been baited. Surely. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, I need to place the door on this before I try and... 
place another bed down. Although I am going to die if I don't do that, actually. Hold on. I need to use my brain here. Just get a double stone doorway. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Jabal is tamed. Let's name this guy Cody. I know he's left the stream, but it's in his memory. <laughs> They should be up most mountains. Yeah, I think most Argies are um, spawned around that area, but I'm quite far away from mountains at the moment, so I don't know what the best way to to go and find one will be. I'd love to just get some metal smelting anyway. How's the whip on bushes? I haven't actually tested the whip yet. That's a good point. Oh, it's like a it's got a cool new animation. It's actually really good. Yeah. It's going to be a decent way to farm some berries and all that. Another death on Scorched Earth. Thankfully, we've got a bed down, so it's not, not that big of a deal anymore. Oops, sorry mate. Alright. I know I'm, I'm I'm encumbered right now. It's because I'm picking up all this useless sand that is like so pointless. Why would you ever need sand? I guess it it must be used for like Adobe structures or something. Hide armor could help, yeah, I probably should get some hide armor. That's okay. Dying's not the end of the world. How are you going to get water at the rat hole? That's a good point. Um, I need to think about that. <laughs> I haven't thought that far ahead just yet. I think there might be a stream actually underneath the rat hole. If I remember correctly. Might, I might be misremembering things, but... Yeah, that could be the way. Um, the Jaboa is huge on my character. I know. <laughs> Should be crushing me. These proportions have just not been very well thought out. Bro, I swear I can never afford the next thing I need to craft. We're only missing a door though, and we've got a fully, fully built base. Which I think is quite impressive on Scorched Earth, considering how often you die. So sad I retired Ark recently, mate. You've got to get back on it. Can we make uh, some metal tools? That's my that's my question. So we got a full base going. The next thing we need is flak. Uh, but first, the metal pick. We've done it. Thankfully, we've made some serious progress. They said it couldn't be done. What else do I need to do? Flak? Are we, we're not high enough level for that yet. I think you can get water from that cactus back there using pickaxe. Yes, I will try that. That's the next thing I'm going to try. I'm actually just going to transfer all of this stuff in there and we'll go farm some metal. I think there's some cactus up there. I'll, I'll, I'll run up and see if I can get. What is this goofy name? <laughs> what do you mean? My tribe name? I need water. It's pretty accurate. Ok, 
Okay, level 44. Let's get this metal into a forge. Bring my raptor over here as well. Wonder if I'm gonna get raided back here. I suppose it is possible. Oh, I'm dying once again. I really need to make some of this. I was gonna say desert cloth, but we're dying of the cold, not the heat. Fortitude! <laughs> Fortitude is next, mate. I promise I'll level that instead of health. Because I, I, I just keep dying. It is true. I'm gonna run up there and get some, some water, hopefully from this cactus. I never tamed a phoenix before, neither have I. I've never really had a need to, to tame one though. Oh, it actually does make your water go up. That is, a, that is insane. That is a gift from the gods. I'm gonna grab a bunch of this. Get Desert Cloth for taming RG? Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do that. Um, I wonder if I could get some crystal for a spyglass as well. I don't know if there's any crystal spawns in the area, but... If there is, let me know. If you know of any. I think the only thing we're missing is a mortar and pestle. Is Hatchet better for cactus? I think it might be actually. I'm dying again. It is what it is. I'll take it. Is this PvP? It is. We're playing solo small tribes, day one. Desert cloth day, hide night. I know, I'm gonna have to keep like switching them around, which is sort of a pain. Is anyone else streaming at the moment? Um, Imian is, it seems. Yes, I know, I'm coming. I'm sorry. Bro's not happy with me for some reason. Ben was. Oh, did he stop? I'm looking forward to that Xavi stream later. I'm sure he's going to hop on it soon. It's just been an unfortunate time zone from it for him. Oh, this guy is very chatty at the minute. I wonder if a storm is coming. Alright, we'll fill the forges up, get a bit more metal. This guy is screaming in my ear. I think that means a storm storm is coming. Crystal at 51, lat 74 long. Oh, you're an absolute legend, mate. I'm going to head there straight after this. Once I get these forges filled. Hello, mate. Thanks for joining the stream. At the moment, we're just playing solo small tribes on Arc Ascended. The new Scorched Earth map. Struggling a little bit out here because, yeah, the, the environment is ridiculous. I do remember it being this bad, but it's still a shock every time. <laughs> still hard to get used to. Wonder if there's any more metal about here. Yeah, there's another rock.
you were gone for a few minutes. Looks like you're starting to get a good starter base. I know we're making some progress. We're not making a lot, <laughs> but we are getting there. Our little stone base is coming along. So hopefully it shouldn't be too long before we get uh, an RG together and then we can head to our rat hole location. Are there new dinos? There is. There's uh, the Oasisaur and the Fasolosuchus, I believe it's called. Um, it's a little bit of a... I didn't I didn't really check out the Fasolosuchus, but I did watch Bam's stream on it. And it's quite interesting. It's not a traditional tame. I think you have to put C4 on the mound when it goes underground. And then, yeah. Are you going to tame an Oasisaur? I'll give it a good go. <laughs> I couldn't find one on single player, but I'm down to try You might be in a good spot, which lets you avoid the storms. Ah, oh, fingers crossed. I absolutely hate the weather events on Scorched Earth. They do my head in. Bam is trying to tame one right now, and it's a pain. Yeah, I, I imagine it would be. Ah, uh, yeah, it looks like my Jabal was right. A storm is in fact coming. I'm just going to split this. I cannot make you guys sit through me running metal to my base. <laughs> I'll come back for that other half. I'm going to be honest, this looks miserable. Oh, it's not that bad. Scorched Earth is... It's not the worst map in the world. Still rather this than... Uh, I don't know. I don't even know what my least favorite map is, to be honest. How do you tame an Oasis Saw? I do not have a clue. I think someone said in the chat it might be like a cannonball tame. Which makes sense. You're like you knock it out with cannonballs or something. Scorched or Aberration harder? I think Aberration's harder. I don't know what the consensus will be on that, but it's... I don't know. Aberration really... I found that so difficult when that map released, but I was playing like a very long time ago. So I've gotten a little bit better. We are going to die here, that's alright. We might as well die here and then head out and look for Crystal at that at those coordinates that guy sent earlier. Aberration is my nightmare. Yeah, it's... It is a pain. Sometimes it's just a bit too much to, to handle. I'm gonna get knocked out here. Oh, once again, succumbing to the elements. Death essence of a fallen tame. You put dead dino soul into pond on back and it triggers a series of mini games. That's actually, that's kind of cool. That's very unique. Aberration is my all-time favorite. Yeah, a lot of people have, are quite uh, big fans of Aberration, which is fair enough. Okay, now I'm not dying of anything but thirst, which I guess is a improvement. Uh, I might as well just kill myself anyway, because... Yeah, we're going to head out with a full um, full HP bar. Any notable differences between this and the old Scorch? So far, it's like the difference is night and day. The map itself has got so many changes to it. It's like playing a whole new game almost. It's just as hard, but... Yeah, the map is like, feels very changed to me at least, but I don't know what everyone else is sort of feeling yet. Alright, can we make some desert cloth? Because we are dying of heat. We can make most of it.
Yeah, right. We'll take this. We'll go out and get some crystal. You like Scorched Earth the most? Ah, uh, look. Fair enough. Each to each to his own. <laughs> I don't know if any people are gonna agree with you, but I respect it. Right, where was that crystal coordinate? Fifty-one seventy-four. Okay, I need to remember that. How many people are on the server with you? It's capped. I think we need to head this direction. Too easy. Seen someone failing tame Oasis or using ascended shotgun. Jeez. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it solo. It started before you, but you're doing better than me. Ugh. It's alright, mate. Keep keep at it. You can't give up. <laughs> it's, it's only going to get better from here. Okay, green orb is quite close. Not going to lie, I have forgotten the coordinates I needed to go to. Oh, that's, that's, that's rough. Okay, we can't spend too much time here. Yeah, I should have taken some cactus sap, but that's alright. I'll... I'll get some more while I'm out. Okay, this could be bad. They're both level 10, so we might actually just be able to fight them. 5174, thank you, mate. Really appreciate it. How old are you? I am 19. Uh, hello, Adam. Back once again. It's good to have you in the chat, mate. Oh, this is bad. Okay, we're alright, we're alright. Hearing an RG. Oh, that's bad. That is not good. This guy's going for me. This this could be the end of my metal tools and the raptor, unfortunately. Oh no, he stopped. He stopped following me. Okay, there must be a, a rat hole there. I just need to get away from that RG. Whip him off? Oh yeah, that's that's true. I don't know if you can whip people off RGs. There's another stone base here. Oh, Someone's got... This could be a raid. I need to keep that in mind. Fifty-one seventy-four. I have gone well beyond that. <laughs> Actually, we just need to head... Back in the direction of the RG, unfortunately. Right. I'll be here till you end stream. I'm really enjoying the stream. Thank you so much, man. That's actually, that's so kind. Really appreciate it. Um, Casper with the $2.49 euro... I said it right, said the right currency this time. Thank you so much. Maybe you can place a water well on a cart for water. I haven't thought of that. Well, there's a guy here. Oh, he's going for that bag as well. I need to check that bag. He definitely lives in that base as well. Surely he dies to that terror bird. Where was his bag? 
This is it here. Okay, it had like nothing in it. Ah, oh, mate, you're giving me the stupid swamp thing. Had nothing but a lot of wood. Okay, there seems to be quite a few bases around the green orb area. I do need to be mindful of that. 4772 potential raid. How do you even know what server I'm on? <laughs> That's concerning. Or is that the coordinates on my map? Yeah, it must be. I think the crystal must be up there, because um, I'm not seeing it around here, and I am at the right coordinates, I believe. How do I get my game to run so smoothly? It's honestly just because I have quite a decent PC. It's the quartz to the one I found, yeah. Thanks for writing that one down, I will, I'll have to remember it. <laughs> I'm really struggling uh, to find this crystal. Oh. I've crashed. Hang on. Let me uh, hide my server quickly. Sorry about that. Um, just gonna join back so nobody sees the the server I join, and then I'll I'll bring the the screen back. Right, sorry about that. That was a bit odd. Servers might have... I don't know what's happened with the servers. That was very odd. Just kind of disconnected randomly. Hopefully we'll load in soon again. Hmm, I'm really struggling here. I'll restart my game and see if that does it. Uh, but how was my day? It was great.